Hi everybody, this is Bruce with Hibowski Studio. And today uh, I'm going to be painting with this group I found online, Plain Air Painters in Maine. Never done this before, but I thought I'd reach out to, to other people. No one's here yet, it's quarter eight in the morning. We're at the Sunken Gardens in Wiscasset, Maine. Right along busy Route 1, right in the middle of town before you cross the bridge to go towards Damascata. And I'm going to paint this view, uh, probably a vertical and probably a 9 by 12 to give me some room obviously and of course using my gorilla box and i probably won't show if i get a chance i'll show some in progress shots but if people start showing up i'm not sure how comfortable they'll be with me filming or whatever so uh we'll have to find out later so it rained a little uh quite you know a lot last night and a little this morning and this is why i bring that little piece of tarp to put my backpack on so I can keep it near my other gear in case people want to paint near me in the same area so but to keep your stuff off the wet ground so I got the block end going really liking the composition and uh, whoops it's on this side and we'll see how it goes I'm um, gonna work on detailing the rock wall then move on to some patches of tone to get the sunlight parts in then detail later but pretty nice spot. I'm in the shade. It's going to work out. Here we are, another few minutes here with this uh, value sketch, burnt umber. Uh, something to think about when you're painting rock walls is to just don't get haphazard about how you put the rocks. I mean, obviously, I'm not following every little detail. You could if you wanted to spend time. But uh, just be sure that the seams, the vertical lines in the rocks are offset from each other because that's how you build a rock wall. You wouldn't have the seams lining up ever. So little tip. Here's how the progress is going and uh, liking it, especially liking how I'm handling, I guess they're lilies, I'm no botanist, but I believe they are. And now I'm going to slap in the highlights on the stairs, get some uh, light going and uh, coming along. Uh, I usually don't do flowers, so this is a nice learning curve. And I'm using a warm and cool of each primary black and white and umber. Okay, I'm back. This little uh, post-painting video of what I did uh, this morning out at Wiscasset at Sunken Gardens off Route 1, right in like uh, downtown, if you call it downtown. It's like two blocks of buildings. But uh, you'll see in the earlier parts of the video there's a lot different stuff up here and I decided it was just too busy and I decided to just make this my own little place to be and uh, sometimes that's what the plain, areas, uh, plain air paintings about and hey you know what I had fun I usually don't paint flowers and of course I'm gonna be working on this a little more uh, this is the day I painted it so I'm letting a couple layers tack up the one thing that was cool was I Initially had this drawn out with the lines of the rocks and everything, tried painting each rock, and I said, no, nah, that just doesn't give me enough artistic. So I just kind of made different grays and everything, melted everything together, applied some paint with a palette knife, and just to get some textures, and then I scraped some of the paint off with the palette knife, and then I went in with the lines. So once this uh, dries up, and then I put in second layers, punching up, uh, obviously, where the sunlight's coming through in certain areas, it's going to, think, be uh, pretty nice, but I'm pretty happy with it. And uh, the planers, planer painters of Maine, it's a little informal group, and ended up there was probably about 10 people that showed up at this location to paint. They kind of, uh, each chapter person that's kind of in charge of the, each chapter, there's western, northern, I guess, and then uh, this one is in southern Maine, a little much for me, but um, pretty cool people, and... Uh, I didn't do any filming uh, too much after a couple little segments that you saw because I wasn't sure how comfortable would they be being filmed or it would be weird with me because I had one lady standing right next to me. So, But I hope you uh, enjoyed this video. Not uh, usually uh, as detailed as my others, but I thought you'd find it of interest. Something a little different for me. And thank you for watching. And if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. and. For the subscribers that have uh, signed up, 
thank you so much. It really means a lot that you enjoy my videos. And does anyone have any comments? Put them in the description box below. And thank you for watching. And hopefully I'm going to check out see where the Western Main chapter is going to paint uh, next week. I'll see how that goes. I'm enjoying it so far.